Hi guys, this is Warped Apps here, and um, today I'm going to be doing um, an SDK tutorial, but not really an SDK tutorial of like, um, like Xcode, but it's going to be a script editor um, tutorial, and it's going to be how to make speech synthesis, um, and it's going to be a really quick tutorial, and where does it go? Apple script editor, and um, I'm going to say, say, space, in quotations, space, with, and this is the um, the speech synthesis thing, so I'm going to say Bruce. I'm going to play around with this a little, though. And um, I just compiled, but I did a keyboard shortcut, which is Command-K, if you're wondering. Um, just so you know what I did. So then all these letters turn different colors, and then in here is what you're going to say. Hi, this is a test. And uh, this should be fine. Uh, that makes it sound a little smoother, I guess, maybe. Hi, this is a test. Hi, Hi this is a test. So you can see that worked, and you can, I'm going to do it with, um, maybe, yeah, that works. Hi, this is a test. Oh, well, um... Um, what's another one? Now let's go into system preferences and look at all the different voices. Um, speech. Alex. There's Alex. Ooh, I'm gonna do Fred. Hi, this is a test. Hi, this is a test. Um, well, apparently it doesn't really... Okay, so, um, you can do it with Bruce, you can do it with a bunch of different ones, but I'm going to be using Bruce. And, um, you can have this line over and over again, so you can say, can, the statement can be as long as you want, it could be like an entire Harry Potter book, I guess, if you really wanted to. Compile. I'm gonna copy this and um, um Bruce. Hi. I don't. I don't really like you. So I'm just thinking of these on the spot. Um, popsicles rule. I'm not sure I spelled popsicles right, but if you compile. Hi, this is a test. I am Bruce. Hi, I don't really like you. Popsicles rule. Um. Yeah. I don't know. See, now it's doing Fred or something. Um, I'm going to say with Alex. Okay, so you can't use Alex. Um... Uh, you can use Bruce. Bruce is the most simple, or the most complex, it's the best that the that Apple has right now. So, um, okay. So I kind of messed it up somehow. I don't know how, but that's how you do it. Um, kind of didn't work for me at the end, but um, yeah. So that is how you do it. Um, you say say space in quotation marks what you want to spa say doesn't have to have any capital or proper punctuation at the end I mean you should probably try but it doesn't and you have to spell stuff right for it to pronounce it right 
but you could say, um, say, with Bruce and run it. And it says whatever you want it to say, and that that's how you do it. Um, and you oh, I forgot to show you how to make it into an application. I said I was gonna do that. So um, I'm gonna start over. Say and um, what what we're gonna say is I'm gonna say um. This is a tutorial. This is a tutorial. Hmm? Well, this is a cool app. This is a cool app. This is a cool app. So, uh, Bruce is kind of messed up for some reason. Um, oh, I know. There. This is a cool app. This is a cool app. And, um... This is a cool app. So now, if you want to turn it into an application, you, you say Command-Shift-Save, or just go up to the File menu and select um, Save As, and I'm going to save it as an as um, an application, and you don't need to change anything else. Um, I'm going to change it to Desktop, and I'm going to call it um, Say Tutorial. And then there's your application. I'm not sure how to add an icon to it if you really want to do that. But um, here's Say Tutorial if we open it up. This is a cool app. And then it kind of just quits itself. This is a cool app. And yeah, that's pretty much how you do it. And um, yeah.